Assalamu alaikum and welcome back to science lesson. In today's lesson, you will learn what are some loud or soft sounds. By the end of this video, you will be able to understand that sounds seem louder if they are near to you because the source is near. And as you go away from the source of sound, the sound gets softer. Let's get started with the lesson. What are some loud and soft sounds? Look at this picture. What do you see? Very good. A crying child? Yes, some sounds are loud like the crying of a child. What sound a clock makes? Some sounds are soft like the ticking of a clock. Now, can you feel the difference? The crying of the child is loud sound. He is the source of a loud sound. The ticking of a clock makes soft sound. Clock is a source of sound, but they both make different types of sound. The baby makes loud sound and the clock makes soft sound. So now you will be able to understand the difference between loud and soft sounds. Can you think of other loud and soft sound? Look at the pictures. Drum, xylophone, which of these instruments make loud or soft sounds? Then we have an aeroplane and a bird. Which of these make loud and soft sound? Think about it. Listen around you. Do you hear some loud and soft sounds? What sounds do you hear more clearly? Raj is listening to really loud music. Music is haram and it can also harm your sense of hearing. Raj is listening to really loud music on his headphones. What should he do to protect his ears? Do you think it's healthy for his sense of hearing? Why not? Because it will damage his sense of hearing. What have you learned so far about sound? Let's quickly revise. There are many different sounds around us. Humans, animals, and non-living things make sounds. A thing that makes a sound is a source of sound. Some sounds are loud some are soft. Vibration. Here is a fun activity for you guys. Sound is made when an object vibrates. Now you must be thinking what's vibration. I'll explain you. Press your fingers to your throat. As you can see in this picture, put your two fingers on your throat and try to make some sound and talk. Can you feel some movements in your throat? Those movements cause vibration. That is called vibration. That is vibration in your throat. These vibrations 
travel through air until they reach our ears so see the vibration they travel where through the air and they reach to our ears and that's how we hear the sound the vi these traveling vibrations are called sound waves they are called sound waves when the vibration is traveling through the air to your ear these vibrations are sound waves that are traveling through the air to your ear i hope you find this activity fun there is another experiment try this telephone for this experiment you will need two plastic cups and a length of string you can try different lengths at different times to experience how the sound wave travel to your ears for this experiment you will need two cups you will make a hole using a pencil then a string not two strings on both the ends of the cup and then i want you to go away from your partner okay talk in the microphone it looks like a microphone this is actually your own built microphone you will talk in this one and your partner will put the other plastic cup on his or her ear to hear your voice then you will switch you will put your plastic cup on your ear and your partner is going to talk in his or her microphone in his or her cup and then you will be able to listen how the sound is traveling through the string with the help of air and you will be able to listen identify the sound is it loud or soft you can also change the string length once you're done try a new different length you can try with a shorter string and then with a longer string and tell me how was it i hope you will enjoy this experiment don't forget to go back and answer your online assignment. And then you have a small homework in your activity book on page 82 and 83 about loud and soft sounds. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson and do tell me your experience about these experiments. Assalamu alaikum for today. See you tomorrow. Bye bye.